what you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at how we can remove the dreaded syskey uh, encryption password uh, that's uh, on a windows based system now syskey has been around for a long time and it's a legitimate program that's built into windows um, but just lately uh, there's a lot of uh, tech support scammers from india that are implementing it on people's systems without their uh, permission and of course it locks you out of your system and you won't be able to uh, get back on and it's quite a malicious and spiteful thing to do to someone because obviously the password is encrypted and you won't be able to get back onto your computer so let's take a look at how we can remove this now there is only one piece of software that i know of that will remove syskey uh, and i'll show you it in a second but let's go ahead and put syskey on the system here it's going to open up the run box here so I'm going to go into the search box here and type run and this will open up our run box here and you can see syskey here I'm going to type in syskey click OK and Sam lock tool will want to open so I'm going to click yes there and this is our securing Windows account database what we're going to do here is click update and here we have the tool now the software I'm going to be using is not free uh, but I'm not affiliated with this company it's the only software I know that will remove syskey so you can see here password startup and what you want to do here is we're just going to put a password in here we'll put that uh, password in like that so now if they will put in this password in and they've remoted into your computer this is what they're going to do and they'll do it a lot quicker than what I'm doing it here and once you click OK it will change your account database startup key and it will encrypt that password so it's not worked at the moment but now when we reboot the system it's going to show uh, encrypt the password and you'll see this so let's go and restart the system so windows will start start booting up and uh, what will happen is you will get interrupted with the syskey prompt box and there you go and that's it you won't be able to get in now that password is encrypted and you won't be able to log into the system via safe mode or any of that so if you don't put the correct password in and push enter it will just keep popping this box up just like so and that will be it you'll be stuck stuck at this screen and you won't be able to access your computer so let's take a look at how we can remove it so you're going to need to enter your BIOS and you can do that by pushing the F2 key or delete key or whatever key that is designated to enter your BIOS now once you get into your BIOS yours may look slightly different to this you may have the more modern type BIOS uh, which is the UEF UEFI or or something like that it doesn't really matter as long as you boot to your device uh, which is going to be either USB or uh, or CD or DVD so we're going to go to boot here and it will be the same in your BIOS you just need to go to the to boot up priority order and then change this to whether it be CD or USB flash drive once you've got that uh, loaded up you're going to click F10 and then save this and say yes and it will then uh, boot to that device now the software will start to load and uh, all we need to do here is let this load up now this software as I said is not free it's from Parscape uh, but it's the only software I know that will actually remove syskey okay now we're going to get our reset windows uh, prompt box pop up and uh, there you can see uh, the recovery mode which is SAM and that's what we want to use and uh, we want to make sure we use the what do you want to do we're going to use the drop down menu here and select uh, remove uh, sensitive information so we're going to do this and then make sure Sam has uh, got the radio button in there and click next. Now we need to give it a job to do. So what we're going to do is use the drop down menu and click reset syskey. Click on reset syskey and add that into the top. And now we need to load up our registry IVES, which is our Sam file. So we're going to use the drop down menu here and put the location in. Also the system registry hive and the security registry hive. Don't worry about the bottom one and the top one they'll be grayed out uh, we don't need to use those so next we're going to click on next now we can reset and change our password permanently 
And what this is going to do is open up another box with some information on it. You want to pause the screen at this stage and read all this information. If any of this if affects you or affects your computer, then click no and back out. But if you're OK to continue at this stage, then you can click on yes to reset your syskey. Sys so we're going to just quickly click on yes here to continue. And now you should see this this key was successfully reset. All your passwords for every user account will be reset to blank. OK, there'll be no password there. So what we want to do here is click OK. And then restart our system so you can remove any USB flash drives or any DVD ROMs uh, CDs from your drive bay and uh, restart your system on restart. It should start to load up and you should get straight to your desktop and the sys key should be successfully removed uh, from your system. And we're just going to quickly let this log in. And there we have it. We're back at the desktop. So I hope this one helps you out, guys. I hope this solves all your problems. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk and I shall see you again for another video. Bye for now. Thank you.